Hey guys, welcome back to another video. I have not made a video in forever because something happened to my computer. There was a bug. Everything was laggy, including Steam, Roblox, all of my video, video game things, even like Chrome. I tried going into Roblox from the app and the website. It did not work, but it's fixed now. And... I'm just gonna get start, and we are going to be, gotta find the right size. I wanna keep it down here because I'm getting a green screen. I have it, it's just not set up, so you won't have to see my background anymore. But yeah, uh, so this is my, everything, so this is my normal setup uh, my recording setup and when I get techie ish enough I can do something called video pad right here um, this lets me edit my videos but we're going to be playing a game called rise of nations hang on real quick I'm going to do something I know you can't see right now. I will fix it in a quick second. It's loading right now. It's just someone else made the private server and I don't have permission. I May mean, I have permission to use it, just not if I should show it. But right now my Roblox is up, updating. It shouldn't take this long, but to load the game. But I'll be ready. So this is not like the first person games that I play. Um. But we're now ready to play it. This is good. Okay. Yeah, the reason it has this in the background is because everything's mirrored right now. But if I turn it off, it should be fine. So, yeah. My usual country is Russia. Not that I don't like other countries to play as. Like, sometimes I'll play with my friends and it will be all the my friends or cousins and we'll be all the way out in the ocean so i'm like south korea japan colton is philippines colton does play this game but i just want to be alone if you you would think since there's no one since no one's playing with me you'd be like well then how are you gonna fight everyone it's just you there are AI armies inside of the other countries. Right now it's waiting for the territories to load, but I'm just gonna go ahead and get set up. Hang on. My headsets may have died. now perfectly fine I might want to turn my actually that's not bad my voice is louder than this so I turn it up I'm sorry if it gets too loud I haven't recorded this game yet I might turn the audio off but if you don't like these these type of games this is literally the game, but there is fighting. Like, if I wanted to go to war with Estonia, which I might, um, you can. If I'm attacking any country that you live in, I'm sorry. But yeah, it's not like I'm going to be sailing all the way over to Canada, or like going all the way over to the US. 
because every when you capture it, it captures every single state. Like I'm not gonna do that. Like, I want to see if I can find. this again I will but yeah this game is a realistic ish game so if you make factories the <coughs> expenses will go up so we have to maintain the income make it over the expenses so you actually get more money so I mean so you actually get more money if you can't um there's no factory for aircraft parts i will get into it in just a minute so i'll give you little tutorials on the way through if your troops are in the way of the city you can hold shift go off and it ignores it you can build roads a line will pop up you get to click on a city you don't have to restart it every time the line will keep continuing and auto build do cost money though but yeah if you want to declare war on a country you're going to click on one of the cities so like right now I'm attacking Estonia but that was Tartu or Tartu whatever how you, however you pronounce it you're gonna click on the bigger flag you're gonna click justify war goal I always do conquest, but I already click conquest, so it's not there. So conquest is just the strategic try to take over that country thing. And you're going to click justify. I'm not going to click it, but it will show you how long it will take. It's not real life, obviously. If you look at the top, um, days do move really fast. And then after it... It'll give you a pop-up. You can click declare war. You're gonna click the whichever and click declare war. With your troops, you're gonna click how to move them. You can move them and then they'll move. But what if you wanna move them like across a road so they don't die of because they can die of hunger and stuff. If they're on a city, they will get some food and support from them. If you wanna move them along, you can hold shift and click along. Shift, and then when you want to stop, like this is my second last city, I'm gonna move to sort of stop holding shift. They'll move there. I'm gonna turn this off. But yeah, I also there is still sound. I'm also gonna connect these rows. I'm gonna make a factory right here. You can go to buildings and you can select any factory. Depends on the resources you have though. So, I'm gonna do the steel. And after the motor factory, I'm gonna want aircraft. So, I'll show you how, cause I don't think any, most countries don't spawn with the thing you need. like. You need, I don't know if I'm pronouncing this right. It might be Tremurium, but yeah, I'll get into that in just a minute. So we did that, we destroyed the army. We're gonna click auto capture and then <coughs> Estonia. If you destroy their capital, um, their country will start to collapse and fall. But it is the hardest thing to capture, the hardest city. 
So, you're gonna want... <clears throat> Sorry. <clears throat> Some things to do that. I've been playing, I actually wanted to do doors today, to play doors, but I played that way too much. I've gotten to the point I play it too much and I might want to do like challenges, like different types. If you hear that noise, you go over there and then you have to make a choice. It's actually really difficult, depends. Okay, boom, we did it. I'll sh tell you what to do in just a minute. So if we accept it, it is a lot of money, but also a lot of political power. Fuse. I want more building speed, but that's n minus 50%. Stability is something you want. So I'm gonna do accept, just because you won't, these guys won't be annoying. Milita Are you gonna make me do another thing? I'll do nothing. It is a lot of manpower, but I can get some stuff to fix it. But no, no, it is too much. That's not as much, but yeah. So I have our factory. It's making steel. Now I'm going to go make our motor factory. So what you're going to do here is after you uh, finish your work des destroying them, you're going to click. Once you start war, their flag will be right here. You're gonna click on their flag. It should, it will be white for a second, but it'll turn red. That means it doesn't exist anymore. They had seven cities, and now they have none. So it's white right now, is none. You're gonna click negotiate terms, annex cities. It's gonna ask you again. You're gonna click, are you sure? And at the top, it's like a news flash, but like a news bar should be good i'm also going to show you if you want to train a certain type for your troops i will show you how to do that in just a minute airports do cost a lot of money if you have a good ca uh, country your capital should already have one right here so we have moscow that is the capital of russia it says under buildings as an airport not do that. So we got that. You're gonna click inventory, so how you train. If you want them just to be stronger, if you're gonna take on missions near your country, you're just gonna click this, and then you'll get stronger. But if you wanna go further places, you can do a rid and a rid, jungle or winter. I always do winter. But the reason you have these is because, oh my gosh, bro. Oh, 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 I'll take that. So like over here, it says it's in an arid, in an arid. Right here, it's in the Arctic, mountainous Arctic. I think there's a difference, especially for tanks. They move extremely slow. You would expect because it's a mountain. But then you have the sea, it's the Arctic. I actually haven't saw, seen a jungle yet. I'm gonna see if I can find one. If I'm still taking a while, I will do it. There we go. Jungle. Uh, so let's see. Cor Cordoba in Mexico is a hilly jungle. So we're gonna get back over. And I, just because over here, is usually arctic seasons will change it'll have winter or mild winter and then severe winter that's when you want to keep your troops there but look we can make f tanks now i always do mine if you play as russia right here but i didn't want to do that um road Um, okay, there. Sometimes it'll be a little later, sometimes it won't work. Um, but yeah, I move my troops. Well, let's just move them there. 
the reason you're like, oh, why can't you just put a tank somewhere here? Well, let me show you. And you you can you make an infantry, but here, look at this. If you look to the right, the city has to have at least a million population. But if you go to here, St. Petersburg. For some reason, that's the name of the city and the country, in another country. But you're gonna click here. It has four million. This is where I always make my tanks. This is the city where I build them. But you also can develop cities somewhere else to get more populations. Like if I go here, up here, develop city. It increases manpower and attacks game. Fortifications, airport, special, the electronics. Raises stability. It's 25 million, but I don't have all the parts. See, look, severe winter, right by my mouse. So, you go here, you get the ticks. National Monument. That is a lot of money. It says a lot of stability, though. I'm gonna, I might do it. It's plus five stability, so it is a lot, but now I have, like, no money in these type of terms, but... Yeah, so now I'm gonna lay off on the things that I'm gonna build and stuff. I'm going to build, put my text there. But, okay, so, here's how you make the aircraft manufacturer. See, I don't have chromium. Uh, so sad. You're going to go to the economy section, right there. I press either for the technology, you can just click it or press A. If you're on computer, of course. This is on phone or mobile. Um, you just got, if you're on mobile, you click your, your big flag and it brings you up. It'll automatically bring you to economy, which is nice. You go to resources slash trade. And then if you want Torium, you're gonna go here, you can click trade and then you find one with however many units so I always buy them from Zimbabwe I want 12 units I want to buy it so that's 570,000 and I have 66 million should I do it yes I'm gonna do it nice boom we have that and I'm gonna make a Another thing now. This looks like a big city. Yeah, it is a really big one. So I'm going to make a road to Moscow. Connecting this. Are you going to connect? No, you're not. I'm going to build it for you then. Boom. Which has more? Okay, that has barely any. So I'm going to. Do they cost money? It's 25 million. I want to make them. Um... Okay, fine, I'll wait. Well, that's real annoying. Alright, I'm gonna. I promise there would be some action. I've only done some one day, so we're gonna do this one. Random country. I don't know what it is. And then we'll go on to Athenia. And then maybe Belarus. Belarus. I do not know what that was. I'm so sorry. Aircraft. It units. That is not bad, but it is expensive. And I don't like it. What is this? What is this? What is this? And oh, <laughs> it's literally a city. <laughs> Hello? I can't even move on this. There it is. What is this, bro? Okay, let's see. 1.3 thousand. 
Yeah, amazing. 1.3 thousand people. Whoa, Antarctica, you're the largest city in the world. It says 200 pe people. 200. Antarctica, I am sorry, but you do not have any people living there. Let me make sense. You are really a lot of corporate deal. It is? Okay. That's a lot of money. I will take it. I can also some of this factory up. Maybe this den. Oh, I can't value anything. Okay. And then I got this. This. Congratulations. You have tanks coming out of you and Russian armies. The tanks do move extremely fast, but you only get 200 of them, yet they do massive damage. Actually, I mean, they are good in fights for backup, but now we take them over even faster. You guys will be my powerful army. You guys be my winter army. You guys will be my winter army. Wa ha ha ha. Wa Just quickly make another unit of tank. I'll be waiting for them to get more tank. With you. Why are you doing anything? You do nothing. The tanks are doing all the The tanks are doing all the you. Okay, I let you leave now. You do way too much work, and most of you dead. Now you wanna go help your friend out. Understood? Better. Okay, you don't exist anymore. Annex, center, goodbye. Bye bye. And now I can get another war going on. Give me uh, two units. Yeah! Alright, we got a lot of tanks. So now, since the other tanks are repairing, we should go up to 500 now. And we have a lot of money. So we do have the aircraft, and we can make planes. Bombers. Fighters. Bombers. Or fighters. Bombers. Bomber. They cost more, but... It's not that much. I like how I said, actually, wait. I was gonna say that 22 million isn't a lot, and then I couldn't do that thing with, um, when I couldn't buy the aircraft manufacturing, but, what's this? This is my tripod. I can hold my phone in there. If you guys want me to make like the series or stuff like on YouTube shorts, I could see randomly like how those things with like series. You know what? No, I, I don't think I would be good at it. Nope, I don't want you to do that. No, nope, no, 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 no. I want you to fight. Fight this goofy uh, guy. Once I take over this mm -mm, country, I, I'll have to end the video. Sadly, this game does not save unless you have another person in the server. But like, no one is going to 
use in use their Roblox account to just stay in here for a few days. Now, if someone were to, they're not going to be checking out there every 15 minutes, clicking a button to make sure Roblox doesn't kick the man out, kick him out. And so my mom will probably do, be doing work. My dad will be going to work, so he's taking his phone with him, and we'd be at school. So there's no point of really doing that. So yeah. Got the airplane. Do you want me to show you how fast they are? I'm just gonna return them back. They go really fast once you get some upgrades. But yeah, look at that just zoom. And they're gonna turn back. It zooms. I mean, it makes sense. It is an airplane. So yeah. What is this? The UK. Okay, bye bye. Taking it over. We'll have to end the video. wondering where I got the blue light from I do have this this came from my box it included the goofy tripod the, the, the goofy tripod it, this this thing in the middle it also can extend just um, I only you have one thing oh wait this right there will extend to hold my phone but I don't have my phone right now so I mean it's here but I don't want to do it and I have to set my webcam back up but yeah I'll be right back. Um, this may be a little too rough to on get. Sorry. Oh great, now I can't get it back. This is not good. This is, how did I do this? How in the, how did I set this up? I have a bit of a problem now. I can't scoot this over. Well, I'm gonna end the video here. I'll see you guys in the next one.